Naam tukiachana na ya bungeni ni kwamba Rais William Ruto aliungana na naibu wake Regaidika Shagwa pamoja na viongozi wengine wa Kenya kwanza katika kuhudhuria mazishi ya nduguye naibu wake huko Mathira katika kaunti ya Nyeri. Uh, basi ni nduguye Regaidika Shagwa Jackson Reriani Gashagwa alifariki dunia tarehe 24 mwezi jana baada ya kuugua kwa muda mfupi. Ikumbukwe kuwa nduguze wengine kama vile Nderitu Gashagwa alikuwa gavana wa kwanza wa Nyeri pamoja na James Reriani pia waliaga dunia kwenye hafla hiyo Ruto alitangaza kuwa kipindi cha uchaguzi na malumbano umekamilika kimekamilika na ni wakati sasa wa serikali kutimiza ahadi zake kwa wananchi Ruto pia alitaka upinzani kuwajibika start with gratitude to god for giving us Jack Reriani for 70 years another gratitude to god is for giving Jack Ririani, my brother, an opportunity to celebrate his project. Regadi Gashagwa, our kid brother. The last week when the inauguration was taking place, we spent together in Karen, and the mood was good, the mood was happy. And I'm grateful to God that Ririani lived to see that day. The man lying here with us, Jack Riyani was the eldest among all the sons of the late Mother Kirigo and Zen Hashi Kishago. He is a man that we all hold in the highest esteem as a family. Our parents, the late Zen Hashi Kishago Riyani and his wife, Mama, popularly known as Marina, were peasant farmers in the next street of fighters. And when they came from the forest, unlike today, they did not know about insurance. What they did about education, they came up with an insurance scheme to make sure that their children go to school. And that insurance scheme by my parents and all other people of that time it was a master stroke. What those parents would do is get as many children, educate a few, and a few to educate the rest. Poleni sana kwa kumpoteza huyu ndugu yetu. Tunajua ya kwamba yeye amekuwa ni mtu wa muhimu sana katika familia hii. Vile tumeambiwa, alishugulika na mambo ya familia hii alishughulika na mambo ya masomo ya familia hii mumesikia naibu wetu wa rais akisema alimsaidia kwa masomo ama kumlipia karo ya shule alifanya mchango wake kama mkenya tumesikia mahali alifanya kazi tumesikia hata mara ya mwisho alikuwa anafanya kazi hapa ya kuhakikisha kwamba mambo ya irrigation katika mambo yetu ya kilimo. Kwa hivyo huyu ni mkenya ambaye ametoa mchango wake katika familia na katika taifa lake.